now. Where the hell am I now? You too. I think the circumstances allow. Gordon was telling me how you found me. Sounds like top drawer detective work. It was a team effort. Batman led the charge. It's not easy to say this, but it looks like you saved my life. I guess that puts me in your debt. It's what I do. I save people. It's a shame we couldn't have saved more. I've got a lot of unpleasant phone calls to make. Hmm. Jim, would you mind giving us a minute? Batman and I have some unfinished business. I'll go check on Joker's transfer, make sure they don't take any chances. Just try not to rip each other's heads off, okay? We can all play nice now that the bad guy's in cuffs. You don't have to worry. Our stalemate from the roof still stands. I'm pulling out of Gotham effective immediately. Then why are we still talking? Tiffany Fox. Riddler's oh. death may have caused a lot of problems, but I won't make her pay for it. I'll leave that to the man who can't stand killing. I know you think I'm the devil, but I want you to understand. I didn't want... I didn't see things going down like this. I let the mission get out from under me. Never really regained a solid footing. Watch out, Waller. Or you might stumble onto an actual apology. You let me talk, we might get there. I just came here to round up the pact. Quick and easy. And if Riddler led you to Sanctus, that would have been a bonus. Listen. Everything I did, I did for the greater good. To protect Gotham, to uphold the law. Whatever your reasons, you went too far. You escalated things on the bridge. You got people killed. And coming after me? What were you thinking? You sided with that maniac. What was I supposed to do? Give you a medal? You act so high and mighty. At the end of the day, you're just a rich guy with all the toys beating up on lunatics. I deal with criminals who threaten my city. You're so far up your own ass, you can't see the truth. You're as nuts as any of them. Avesta had you pegged the minute she walked in your office. She started listing off your pals. All those friends of yours who went cuckoo. Get the Get fuck out of my town. Well, you still can. No! Everything okay? Who We're asked you? done here. Signal the withdrawal. You and your damn pantsuit, get out of my town. I'm not gonna miss her, that's for sure. So, here we are once again. Gotham safe because of you. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it felt pretty good getting my hands dirty. Just like old times, huh? Truth is, after I got ousted, I didn't know my place anymore. Turned into an old guy in civvies, lurking around crime scenes. We have to work together, Jim. Solve cases. Lock up the scum who terrorize our streets. I'd like that. So would I. Oh, uh, I gotta take this. Wife probably saw the news. <laughs> See you around, Batman. Don't be a stranger.
Yeah, see? There was a person. Oh, there we go. Just realized Batman is still out in the daytime. Tiffany, we need to talk. Yeah, I figured. You're hurt. It's nothing. I saw you take much worse. Uh, Joker was going to cut Waller ear to ear. I had to create a distraction. It was certainly distracting. My confession. It took you by surprise, didn't it? I just couldn't keep it in anymore. You know I don't condone killing. Not even scum like Riddler. Moment. Especially since I learned who you are under that mask. I was afraid of what might happen if you found out. I guess I was hoping you never would. I always find out. You should be afraid. I'm sorry. I, I know what I did was wrong. But Riddler tore my family apart, Bruce. Literally. My mother hasn't left the house since the funeral. And Luke? He just lashes out. My father's death broke them. It broke all of us. I won't ask for forgiveness. But I hope you can understand why I had to do it. I just felt so powerless. Like my life was crumbling around me. I had to do something to take back control. Nothing justifies taking a life. Not even a need for revenge. I was hoping because we both loved my dad. You'd be more flexible. You don't see That's me going around killing people. That's not how it works. So, where do we go from here? I suppose this puts me on your most wanted list. Rather than us working together. You're going you to jail, to bitch. Justice, Bye. Tiffany. I wish I didn't have to, but I'm turning you in. You do that to me? You'll get your day in court. Just like any other criminal. I've been a pain in my ass since day one. That's what I thought you'd say. I swear to God, if she jumps. But like any other criminal. You'll have to catch me first. Grapple her by her curls and pull her up. Bitch! Sorry! Oh, you a little asshole. Just see with my grapple gun and flew away. Ah, uh, you going somewhere? I was going to write a note. But I'm not a coward. At least I don't want to be. Not anymore. Where's my sandwich? Again, this won't be the first time I've found my courage in a single malt. Courage for what? You better not quit, I swear to God. Saying goodbye. Oh, God, he's quitting. I'm leaving, Bruce. It's time I went in search of better pastures. You just need rest, Alfred. Why don't you take a long vacation? Some place in the sun, on the other side of the world from Gotham. I rather think this vacation will be permanent. But why? <sighs> this war of ours is not what it was when we started. I no longer have the stomach for it. It's not sustainable. At least not for me. Come on, Alfred. 
You know I can't do what I do, what we do, without your help. Well, maybe you don't have to do it at all. Our mission used to be so clear. Catch the criminals, lock them up. But nothing is clear anymore, at least not to me. Now everything has become so grey. <laughs> grey? Talk to me, Alfred. We used John Doe, exploited his friendship to get you into the pact. We took advantage of someone you met in an asylum, for God's sake. If I recall, you were on board with that plan. Bane had just dropped a wall on your head. It clouded my judgment. If I knew then what I know now, I'd never have let you go through with it. You empowered John Doe, kept him close when you should have put him away, inspired him to become something far more dangerous than he ever was. What's your point? Sometimes, it's as if Batman creates the evil he means to destroy. Mm. For all our good intentions, I fear we only make things worse. A dreadful thought, I know, but one that keeps me awake at night. Oh, please. There were plenty of criminals around before Batman showed up. I put most of them in jail. Two-Face, Cobblepot, Lady Arkham, Joker, all they have in common is you. Anyone who comes into contact with us suffers. Lucius is gone. Tiffany has blood on her hands. I foolishly thought bringing her in might make things better. As if her enthusiasm might remind us how things were in the beginning. The lives we touch are touched by pain. Friends, colleagues, innocents. No one is spared. You think I want that? We can fix the problem, Al, but not if we run from it. Unless we are the problem. Leaving this all behind might be the only solution. One thing is for certain, my tremors are gone. <laughs> well, that's great news, Al. They stopped the minute I made the decision to go. I thought it was the kidnapping with Lady Arkham that caused them. Some kind of residual trauma. But I had it wrong. This sense of powerlessness I've been feeling, it came from something I saw in you. The tremors, the fainting spells, all of it. Alfred, I'm... I'm so sorry. I've caused you so much pain. No, no, please, don't misunderstand me. Let me explain. Your father was driven by an obsession, by a need to control. He rushed headlong into the darkness, thinking himself invincible, oblivious to the cost. Just like you, not like me. I chase that darkness away. And yet, history is repeating itself. I'm more certain of that with every passing day. Okay, maybe I am more like my father than I want to admit, but our paths are different. Can't you see? The paths may diverge, but they end in the same place. Face down in an alley, shot in the dark by criminals in some godforsaken corner of Gotham. I won't be witness to that. I won't bury you, too. I stood by and did nothing while Thomas destroyed himself, along with everything he loved. I enabled him, like I've been enabling you. Realizing this, I've never felt so helpless. I wanted things to be different for you, my boy. You deserved a better life than the one I gave you. I failed you, and for that I'm sorry. Alfred, I'm... <laughs> I'm nothing without you. You're my father. The best father anyone can have hope for. Oh, man. A good father wants his children to be happy and safe. Seeing how far you are from either, it's why I have to go. No. Well, I don't want to miss my flight. There's always traffic around the airport. Man. You don't have to do it, Bruce. There are other ways of doing good in the world. But you, you pour everything into your bloody crusade. And I know you too well to hope you'll ever change. But 
justice. Oh, ooh. oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God, no. Oh, no, no, wait. Oh, God. Oh, dear God. Oh, God. I don't know what to pick. Oh, no. Oh, God, I don't know what to do. I can't give up, Batman. I can't. You're right, Al. It's who I am. I will always be Batman. And that will never change. I know. Rubbish goes out on Tuesday. And there's lasagna in the freezer. I'm sure you'll manage. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, God. Is there an extra scene? Your relationships have been affected by your action decisions within the story. Value relationship choices, validation. Oh, okay, your choice already. Ooh, what's this? You got that look in your eye, the kind that says you're trouble. I was annoyed she couldn't make you admit you were part of the pack, your friend Tiffany. She loved that Bane was left behind, blah, blah, blah. Why she worked for the agency, how he worries she's just another one of all those pawns. Thunderbolt! I'm the whole goddamn hurricane! We're remain in a stalemate. <laughs> Oh boy. Hey. Gotham safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it. Mm -mm, just watch it. It was hurt when you called Waller instead of him to help back up Bane's attack. It feels like the heat demand he gave up Catwoman. Uh, I was grateful when you forgave him for losing his self-control. I weighed my options, and what can I say? I don't like to lose. Uh, it's horrified that Harley sentenced you to death. You left Catwoman's fate up to Waller, and she only serves on the agency's covert task force. Whoops! I won't let you down. I wonder what would have happened if I still chose not to tell her. Wait, a bunch of other people said they would be her mentor? What the fuck? Oh, is she still alive? The criminally insane. You're drawn to them. Oh, she's gonna be working for me. Cool. If a man hides in plain sight for that long, does he forget who he really is? I feel like I need to play this whole episode over. We're two threads in the same stitch, bound together, even under strain. Man, that was a dramatic moment. Who else is there? Wow, a lot of people saved Willie. 
really? People took her with him? Honestly, I was just gonna lie and not bring him in. Okay, who are the assholes I refuse to hear what he had to say? Those photos? Visitor for John Doe. Bruce! Hey, buddy. Now I need to play this whole episode over. Damn it. It's taking a while. There, there we go. Well, there you have it, episode 5. Oh, I, thought, I thought the photos would be in there. Oh, okay, I'm gonna just play the whole episode over again. <laughs>